Welcome to To Enable Help. This video is going to explain to you how to download content onto your Android device using the To Enable Android app. The simple thing is um, you can select the subject and obviously to, to be able to download content you need, need to be connected to a server. So the first thing is I'm going to switch off the server connection so we're not connected to a, a hub or to a server and um, if we pick one of these uh, let's, let's continue with grade 10 because we be consistent you'll notice here when I select a week it gives me a play online but it does not give me a download option okay I cannot download uh, when I'm only connected to the internet here I it says connect to a server to download the content. This is a download icon for this lesson. If I connect to it, I cannot download it. It says connect to the internet. If I want to download the step, so the whole week, it says connect to a server. So it's absolutely essential that you are connected to a server. And that means you need to have, to have connectivity check switched on and it needs to successfully connect to a server so if we choose equations and inequalities what we want to see is that green circle okay now I can download a device okay it was fairly quick I'll try um, download a, a video lesson so week lesson I can actually go to the lesson I can play it if I want to play it or I can download it and there's it's busy downloading the video onto my device. So that was successfully downloaded. So I'm going to now just actually try to play that video. So we can either download individual uh, resources by selecting the resource, or we can download the week, or we can download the entire grade. Okay, and this is all dependent on how much memory your de your device has available. So if I wish to download the whole of week 7, I can, in fact that was something I knew I showed you, I can either select the download button, do you want to download it? So let me just go back there, select the download button, do you want to download 6 files? Or I can swipe it onto my device. So if I grab it from left to right, I don't want to grab the edge, I want to swipe it onto my device. Do you want to download the six files? And I'm not going to continue. If at a later point I want to delete files, I can press delete, and this is a delete. So it'll delete all the files in week seven. So the reason I would want to delete is because I'm running out of space on my device and I need to delete some, some videos. So if I do it the other way, it's going to ask me, do I want to delete? I don't want to delete just yet. So sliding left is a delete. And I don't want to delete. Sliding right is a download onto my device, and I'm not going to do that. And download is that's a download icon, that's a delete icon, and that applies for at all steps. Okay, so I can download the entire grade. So let's say I'll download grade 10, there are 225 files. Okay, if I want to download grade 9, there are 463 files. Um, what I can do is I can download the entire maths onto my device, but I would need a significant amount of memory to do that. So that is how one downloads content. So what I'm going to now show you is the why would why would we download content? So you remember earlier we were in an I keep pressing the wrong button there. Uh, we were offline, so I'm going to switch the hub connectivity off, and I'm going to switch the internet off, and it's going to be in an offline space now. Okay, when I choose mathematics, I'm offline. So if I go grade 10 and we pick, let's pick week 8, okay, nothing is available. Okay, but if I go to week 7 where we actually downloaded some videos, you can see the things that we downloaded are available to play. Okay, this means that I can take these videos home with me um, and I can display them. Um, I can play them at home and I'm not using data. So that's the important thing. The whole issue around this application is to provide students access to 
content without using data because most of the South African students actually do not have internet connectivity. So living in an urban environment is great and you've got an inter internet connectivity but a lot of rural people don't and this target, this is aimed at assisting students with getting access to content. For instance, if I go to algebraic expressions in grade 10, you'll notice, and I'm offline, I have the entire textbook. Okay, this is a Siabula textbook, and it's available for free, but it's 469 pages of textbook. To put this in perspective, it probably takes five seconds to download this entire textbook onto my device. So the whole purpose of what we're trying to achieve here is to find lessons that we that are of good quality which we can give to students to take home that they can access this at home for um, either revision or because they don't understand what uh, they're battling in class. So if you've got resources that are better than what we've got, please cons uh, consider contributing them to us. Uh, we are trying to make the best resource that we can. And uh, the real power of this application is in precisely what we have just demonstrated, the ability uh, to allow students to download this content onto a device that they can then take home with them to um, at, take home and access at home. So uh, I hope that was useful and um, please watch it again because this is by far the most important part of what we're trying to do.